My name is uh, uh, Bob Abner. I was born in Washington, D.C. and uh, lived here in Chesapeake Beach ever since. Well, I made a brief uh, attempt to go to college. Didn't work very well. So I asked my father, uh, what was I to be? And he says to me, uh, you're going to have to be what you really like to be. Don't do anything that you don't like. And he says, if you do what you really are interested in, you will excel in it. The man was right. Not knowing what you're going to do the next day as far as harvesting whatever you were going to harvest. It, it, it always puzzled me what's going to be in that next crab trap? And I think that's why I've been a crabber for 63 years. What's next? Uh, challenging, very challenging. Um, you, looking at the way the crabs move, you almost get an idea of what's going to go on. So you might, you might pick up a couple hundred traps and put them in an area Oh, we're going to get them tomorrow. And then you come back the next day and you stupid sucker, what did you do that for? There's nothing there. Or it could be the other way around. Jackpot. There they are. need regulations. We really do. Uh, as a waterman, myself, I can say I can live with all regulations. But uh, the biggest regulation was only letting us work eight hours a day. And then we can only work uh, six days a week, which before regulations came in, we could work seven days a week. And we could work whenever we wanted to. A waterman, especially one that is just getting started, uh, can never count on anything but itself. You go down on your boat, uh, the wiring's wet, the engine won't start. So it takes you half a day just to get the engine going. And uh, then they put a regulation on you can only work eight hours. Four hours is already gone, and it's a it's a, a pretty handsome fine for working over eight hours. But I can see how they do it, why they did it. And um, in modern times here, I can live with it. And we do need management. We do need management. If we don't have management, things could go very bad for us.